So we start with our first fight. It's six three-minute rounds of heavyweight boxing, sponsored by Burger King, and it is Izu Ogona versus Thomas Piatel. So Izu and Kevin Barry, if you'd come forward, please. Now, having been in Las Vegas over the last month, I've seen firsthand um, the difference in Joseph's training, particularly because of Izu. He lives under the same roof as Kevin Barry and Joseph as well. Uh, Izu. Come along here, tell me what it is like, um, obviously people are very interested in Joseph Parker, but how training is different now that you two are working together? Uh, well, um, hello everybody at first. Um, I think that there are part of the trainings that we can do together uh, that makes it much easier. It's always good to have someone that pushes you. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, boxing is an individual sport and everyone is on his own in the ring. So. Um, I need to know what I'm doing. I know Joseph knows what he's doing. So, uh, but during the training time, uh, it's crucial to have people, good people around you that will uh, will help you push through the hard times. Kevin, if you could just make a, um, some comments on on how hard it was for you to make a decision to bring Ezu into your house as well, because egos, personalities, all that kind of thing, and also looking after Joseph, how how much weight on you, and how it's gone. Well, it was a decision that I didn't make lightly. Um, you know, Joe and I had a pretty special thing, or shall I say we have, a very special bond and a very special thing going. And before I was going to you know, invite not only into my house, but into our training camp, another fighter, I had to find out um, what made Izu tick, what sort of a personality, what sort of a man he was. And um, he, like he's... What I could not believe is um, when I first started working with Joe, I couldn't believe just how much of an impressive young man he was, and all the all the good traits and the hard working uh, ethic, uh, the honesty, and somebody who gave me everything in the gym every day, and bringing Izu into our training camp, I have exactly the same thing. I have someone who has a uh, huge vision. He has fierce determination who trains extremely hard day in, day out. They do the same training. They push each other along. This, um, Joe and I have been together for, this is our ninth fight together. And this, I would say, was probably one of the most enjoyable training camps that we've had with, uh, with both guys training alongside each other every day. Uh, like, he's, he's just a first-class guy. He's a guy who's extremely talented. He's a real athlete. He's a fighter that I'm very excited to be associated with. Um, I'd just also like to welcome uh, Izu's manager, uh, Richard Moriarty, who flew in from Hong Kong this morning. Uh, Richard's with the Union Banking, Union Gaming Banking Group, and uh, uh, he's put a lot of confidence and, and faith in, in Izu, and we think he's got a really bright future. Uh, and I'm very excited with uh, how he's going in the gym, and I'm excited by how things are going to be on Thursday night. Just, just briefly, we know that Bryce Rattani Co has been Joseph's sparring partner. Clearly, Izu is now sparring partner of Joseph Parker. What happens when those two get in the ring? Well, it's like Izu and Joe, um, uh, they spar so competitively together. They actually bring out the best in each other. And uh, when this fight was made with Jason Petaway, and I looked at, I looked at Petaway at uh, six foot four. He's, he's a little bit taller than that. He's about six foot five. He was the uh, the perfect guy for Joe to be working with. And, and most of our sparring this camp, uh, Joe's done 58 rounds of sparring, and most of it's been done with Izu. And it's been uh, it's been very physical, very fierce. Uh, one thing about these guys, they're great mates. They. Uh, spend a lot of time together, they, they uh, were living under my, under my roof, they spend an enormous amount of time together, but the two of them have that much respect for each other when they're actually in the ring sparring each other, it is fireworks, it is full on. Um, and because of that, I think they both brought the best out in each other. Cool, uh, easier if you just stare down to the camera as well if you want to take the shots, and um, as I mentioned, it's six three minute rounds of heavyweight boxing, Thomas Piatel has opponent from Wellington will be here tomorrow for the weigh-in, which is at LSE Racecourse at noon. 